wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. SubhanAllah, just last Wednesday I had the opportunity of visiting my maternal grandfather and grandmother at the Muslim cemetery and it was a very, you know, a very reflective moment for me because just a few days later we received the news of the passing of our dear Sheikh Muhammad al-Sharif and it was a shocking moment for the world and it was something which reminded us of the fragility of life and subhanallah within a few days in my family we received the news of the passing of a very young cousin of mine at the age of 30 subhanallah and it just reminded me of you know the only thing that matters in our life it, it, it gives us the pause and the opportunity to reflect on life and the only thing that matters is the actions that we do those who have passed have passed on we remain and when we remain we have action uh, that we can rely on that we can present to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and work on inshallah uh, inshallah you know it's 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 a stark reminder of of life and it's a stark reminder of what is there to do with the remaining life that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has in store for us so inshallah um, inshallah you know I pray that uh, he gives us the strength all of us uh, you know, to value our time with the people that we have around us, our loved ones, and to be cheerful and to serve our parents and to be creative in the good words and the uplifting words that we say to our children, our wives, our husbands, our colleagues, our friends, and to and to try to take every opportunity to, you know, uplift people and to encourage them to do good and to be a leader and an influencer in the obedience of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.